isn't a place in the country that wouldn't love to have uh, the vacancy rate we have in the Back Bay. I live here in the Back Bay, so I think I have a good sense of it. It's a great place to work, to live, to play. And so I think you have the kind of combination that leads to success. The fact that we're doing well in the Seaport District does not detract from what we're doing in the Back Bay. The market in Back Bay is incredibly strong and it's incredibly resilient. We tend to recover a lot faster. So the, the delta between uh, high and low occupancy periods is, uh, is pretty marginal. And, uh, and it's really based on supply and demand, which has been very, very tight for years. I mean, there's literally been only 340-odd hotel rooms added, added to the Back Bay inventory in the last uh, 10 years. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. And demand is slowly increasing. Generation Y, um, the um, echo boomers, uh, urban hipsters, whatever you want to call them, um, there's 80 million of them out there. It's the largest generation ever, um, and they like to live in urban settings. So um, just as a result of that demographic, um, I think we've seen a shift at the Prudential Center um, towards the young professionals sort of moving into the city and choosing the back bay. I think Newbury Street is about fashion, about food, um, more cutting edge, more variety of fashion, more um, international fashion, whereas in Copley is about luxury, um, you know, definitely a more narrow focus. And the Prudential Center Mall really serves as an entrance to um, the office buildings, uh, so it's pretty safe retail. Everybody's watching this with State Street Bank uh, announcement that they're going to the seaport and with Liberty Mutual consolidating into their headquarters. And so a million square feet on top of a 13 million square foot market is fairly significant. However, I think that uh, when you look at the, this, the market, it's a fairly small sub-market in a very vibrant place, in a place where people want to be. Well, the Christian Science Plaza is about a 14-acre parcel of land in the Back Bay, uh, and it includes about eight acres of open space. We are marketing as we speak through HFF, the administration tower for a 75-year master lease, and we will soon be coming out with the development rights for two of the towers, one of which is a 600,000 square foot, 40 plus story residential tower, and the other is a 200,000 square foot, 20 story plus tower that could be hotel or residential. And so we're very excited about the transformation of the plaza and we look forward to getting it ready for the next 40 or 50 years.